Mike and I have been pushing back and forth throughout the day. Uh, he's been doing some very effective drop techniques. His RPGing is going very well. Um, we've been pushing back, getting territory back. So it's, it's uh, been a nice yo-yo effect so far. I'll give you an update what we got going on here um, it's been crazy I mean it's 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 been hot we've had everybody right now our, our goal today was to try to take the tree line and keep them all out not in, in the speedball field and that's been what we've been that was been the objective from the very beginning we, instead of going right. into the woods oh, yeah. we bolted down the, the, the tree back. line and just tried up. to lock them out yeah. here yeah. and then uh, that's pretty much been our objective trying to get them you know try Careful to warm them up get them tuckered out by the heat and uh, hopefully what we got about Another two, Keep three more hours yeah. left. Hope there shouldn't be too many of their players left out there on the field. So that's been our objective from the beginning. It's been a little bit tricky because although we control the woods, they've been getting very, very close to me here at the base, but it's been very difficult for them to turn the corner. So we've been trying to keep them all contained in that Sydney area. And uh, that, that's, been the, uh, that's been the goal so far. So it's, it's, as we think we start doing good, Wolf ends up sending helicopter missions over and it ends up just wrecking everything we have planned. So uh, it's been going both ways. It's been, it's been pretty crazy all day long. Devil, you've been down here today. Would this be your first Canadian experience? This is my first time in Canada. Yes, it is. I was invited up here by the uh, Northern Gunmen, uh, excellent play players, uh, great partners, great people, and uh, they told me I would come. I should come out to Canada and check out their uh, their little event here. And uh, you know what? They haven't disappointed. It's been a blast. The uh, producer is actually a Viper, and uh, the the game format, obviously, and the field itself is just playing phenomenal. Uh, the people are great. I mean, I. I always knew Canadians were good to go, but hanging around these many Canadians, man, these guys, they're, they're fun. They're fun, and quite honestly, I thought there was going to be more cheating. But um, it's, I'm glad I was wrong, because these guys have been uh, stand-up players. Uh, they've been bringing it to me, I've been bringing it to them, and, you know, they've actually been getting out when they've been hit, as am I, you know. So um, it's been a good time. It's been a good time. Um, now, what would have been one of the really memorable uh, moments on the field today? Mm. Oh, bar none. Um, I came up here with uh, Sonny Lopez from the Alley Hitman, and uh, yeah, we have a little thing going where if he finds me, I shoot him, and if he, obviously if he finds me, he'll shoot me, and he's, uh, he's capped me quite a few times today, and he's made it a point to let me know that he's got me, uh, so that's been a little seesaw battle back and forth, so that's pretty memorable, you know, like, it's, it's pretty fun, it's pretty Did fun. Did you hand it back to him at all? You know, <laughs> he said one bounced off. His elbow, so technically he didn't get out. But I mean, I'll give him that because uh, Sunday's a stand-up player. So, um, to my knowledge, I haven't killed him yet. But he's taken me out at least two or three times. You know, that's so that's it's not bad.
Lopez at Canadian Carnage. You're watching Cat Shack Reports. Hope to see you on the field. are being redirected. We are living in an artificially induced state of consciousness that resembles... 